More about a 4th of July murder on Tucson South Side. It happened on East Elevado Road near 6th Avenue in Irvington. That's where we find News for Tucson's chief investigative reporter, Chorus Nylander. Chorus, what are you finding out about what happened last night? Yeah, well, Monica, that deadly shooting happened at the home here just over my shoulder. Tucson police say it all happened after an attempted robbery here inside. A man, his girlfriend, and two infants. I spoke with several neighbors in the area here who tell me they know the suspected shooter well. Uh, Tucson police have identified the man who was killed as 31-year-old Freddie Wayne Bat Jr. Police say based on the evidence uh, throughout their investigation here, they uncovered that Bat came over to the home, started demanding drugs and money from the family inside, trying to rob them. A man confronted during the robbery pulled out a gun and shot him, uh, ultimately killing him, then left the scene with his girlfriend and those two infant children uh, looking for help. Angel Turchis lives next to the home here. He says he knows the suspected shooter well, that he's a 19-year-old man. He says he supports his decision to defend his family. He's got his girlfriend and the kids, and, and he was trying to protect his family. I would, anybody would do the same, you know, to protect your family. And at this point, police have not identified the suspected shooter in this situation. Charges related to this case, uh, they say, are pending. They did make what they called arrests. They used the plural term, uh, but they said it was for unrelated uh, charges to this case. This now marks the 27th murder in Tucson so far this year. As we learn more information, we'll keep you updated. For now, we're live from Tucson Southside. Chorus Nylander, News 4 Tucson. All right, thank you for that update, Chorus. Well, social media posts.